And reactions continue to pour in as far as the News 18 survey is concerned on the Uniform Civil Code. The latest one to respond to it is Minority Affairs Minister Mr. Zama Khan, who has spoken to CNN News 18 from the JDU. He goes on to, in fact, say that it is thanks to CNN News 18 that the survey has been conducted and there needs to be a level playing field for all the members of the society. Let's first go ahead and take a look at what Mr. Khan has to say about the UCC and the News 18 survey. 65% support this. We are supporting it. Look, this is the government and the government. We are standing with it. The rest of the survey is still going. The survey is still going. It's not going to be done. लेकिन हम ये कहेंगे कि ऐसा कुछ नहीं करना चाहिए जिससे किसी को चोट पहुंचे और जिनकी बात कर रहे हैं जो सर्वे करवा रहे हैं या जो देश की हालात जो लोग कर बैठा है वो आप भी जानते हैं हम भी जानते हैं आगे चुनाव है चुनाव को देखते हुए कुछ भी मुद्दा उठाकर उसी पर चल रहे हैं कोई काम से लेना देना नहीं विकास से मतलब है जो उन्होंने बहुत पहले जब चुनाव के दौरान जब आते थे घोषणाएं करते थे उस घोषणाएं का कोई चर्चा नहीं हो रहा है आप भी जानते हैं और हम भी जानते हैं मंच पे आते थे तमाम तरह की बातें तमाम तरह की वादा उन्होंने किया था उस वादा के मुताबिक न वो खड़ा उतरे हैं न आज मंच पर बात करते हैं न बात सुनना चाहते हैं मैं ये कहना चाहूँगा कि जो का चुनाव है उसको लोग एजेंडा बना चल रहा है कुछ भी इस देश की हालत बिगड़े या बने उसे कोई लेना देना नहीं है उनसे सीट का मामला है उनका स्वार्थ का मामला है कहीं कहीं धार्मिक भी मामला है कभी आस्था का भी विषय है और उस चीज़ पर जो लोग मुद्दा बनाने का इसलिए काम करता है कहीं ना कहीं किसी को चोट पहुंचे और हमेशा ऐसा लोगों ने राजनीति किया है let me bring in my colleague Saurav on the broadcast who's got us that interview with Mr. Zama Khan. Saurav, I wanted to understand what has been JDU's official view on the Uniform Civil Code. Here we see Mr. Khan lauding the efforts by Network 18 survey. We wanted to also understand is this the official view of the party that they speak about gender justice as far as UCC is concerned? Uh, yes, indeed, because JDU uh, so far is against uh, the Uniform Civil Code uh, and uh, they are waiting for the draft as well. They said that let the draft come, then we will take a better stand. But as of now, uh, the, the, uh, as we spoke to him, uh, he also said that this is the stand of the party and he's going to support the, uh, the party's stand. And uh, right now, the party as well as the other RJD, which is in coalition uh, in, in Bihar, these both major party in Bihar, they are against uh, the Uniform Civil Code. And uh, as we heard uh, the Minority Affairs Minister, he, he was saying that this is uh, a part of politics, uh, a political game which is being played in the country. And uh, it, it, it is because the, the BJP is trying to, uh, you know, uh, divide the nation in the name of religion is what is being alleged by uh, the opposition here. And now uh, the state government of Bihar uh, comprises of the Mahagathbandhan, which is mm -hmm. JDU, RJD and Congress. And they all have the same stand that they are going to oppose uh, UCC unless a, a, a draft uh, is brought, which is in the favor of the common man. But so far, uh, because the draft has not been brought, uh, they are against uh, the, the you know uh, uh, the rumors or the uh, the statements that are being given. It clearly shows that the parties uh, in the line are opposing UCC right now. All right, thank you so much for that, Saurav. Uh, and let's also now play out for the reactions that continue pouring on the survey and also on the Uniform Civil Code. We begin with Priyank Kharge. I have not seen your uh, survey, but more than that, let BJP come out and tell the benefits of UCC for the Hindu undivided family. What will they do with that? There are, what will they do with the, for the tribals in the northeast who are opposing that? Then we will discuss all this. You all have might have done your job by going around to the people and asking. Every bill when it has been bought, you will go to the public and ask how far it is useful for public. That is what the media has been doing it, and we appreciate the media for that because all the pros and cons are been known to the public representative only by the media. Whether it's a Muslim community or whether it's a Hindu community person or whether it is a Christian community, that is not the matter at all. If the country is prepared to have a uniform civil code, is the matter to be discussed. You will have to do it for the country's unity and security and safety and also to keep up the uh, plural structure of this country where people are lived in a secular uh, fabric of this country and that has to be strengthened for sake of political needs whenever the elections come nearby you take up these kind of uh, sentimental issues for your political needs that is what the congress objects about it